I've been at the Santa Cruz Sentinel as a staff photographer for 25 years now. And over that quarter century, I haven't lost my enthusiasm for going and taking the pictures of the moments that are extraordinary and ordinary in our community. And it's a lot of the ordinary moments that are actually have that extraordinary quality and uh, importance. People, people ask me all the time, what, what is your day like? And, and as cliche as it sounds, there is no typical day. It's a lot of driving, a lot of looking for, uh, for that picture, a lot of talking on the phone to find out where I need to go. The typical day is, is usually coming into the office. Uh, there's two photographers now, two full-time staff photographers. First one in, makes the schedule, sees the assignments. Uh, the reporters have assigned the photos. Uh, and then going out and taking the pictures and uh, usually looking for some what we call freestanding pictures, pictures that are just stand on their own. Uh, nice moments, uh, interesting ways that we as photographers see the world and are able to, to get a picture to show that in the paper. We typically put 1,300, 1,400 miles a month on our cars and all in Santa Cruz County. So I might be in Davenport in the morning and then Paro in the afternoon. It's, a, it's, it's doing a bit of a dance with, uh, with the emergency responders trying not to be in their way, trying not to endanger myself or other people and still trying to get a picture that's dynamically interesting and storytelling at the same time. Um, and just, you know, not, once again, not getting in someone's way, not endangering my own life when I'm covering a forest fire and, and things like that. Um, one, one of the things I really appreciate about uh, shooting the photos, the portraits for the Gail Rich Awards, is the collaborative aspect of the project. Working with the artists to conceptualize what we're going to do, how we're going to take a picture, and what that picture is going to mean helps me to get a better picture and helps them to have ownership of it and together we do things that that I think that uh, hopefully convey really the personality of the artist and and something about the work they do um, and I think that because they're so collaborative the artists are willing to do things they might not do otherwise because they feel an ownership. The upcoming show at the Cuomo Jazz Center with uh, Wallace Bain and myself I believe is titled Back by Semi-Popular Sort of Kind of Demand. I th It's something like that. We don't really have a title for this show. It, it's the, the upcoming show at the Coomba Jazz Center is called Back by Semi-Kind of Sort of Popular Demand. It's an evening of words and pictures with Wallace Bain and myself. Um, hopefully entertaining, funny, poignant.